admit the last date the hard way? Oh, give me, give me, give me some. Just a minute, Mr. Eager. I'll tell Tony you're here. And if you college kids think you can... Why, Johnny? Michelangelo did his best work on his back. Uh, what's the matter with you, Eager? What's the matter with you? You, my friend, you slogan. You didn't send it in, Luce. You're not kicking through. And that's a perfect way to stop being friends with me. But I do send in every week. Yesterday night, I give a Lou Rankin five a grand. Listen, Eager, I always send in. Rankin, huh? All right, then chase your dame here and we'll My talk. dame? She's another my dame. Why, Mr. Eager, what would Cyrano say? Okay, Tony, go out with Jeff and spill it to him. Nothing to be frightened of, Miss Bard. Well, I'm not frightened. We'd sort of like to ask what you're doing here, though. Would you like to be asked that, Mr. Eager? You're not casing Tony for that sociology racket of yours, are you? Hardly. The gentleman I was with this evening became quite intoxicated. Drunk, in fact. Excused himself and wandered away, leaving a bill for $85. Mr. Lou suggested I leave some of my jewelry as collateral. But I couldn't see it that way. I've been trying to explain to Mr. Lewis that the young man is many times a millionaire and I would see that he sent a check with a bonus in the morning. Mr. Lewis couldn't quite understand. Uh -huh. What are you doing here, Mr. Eager? Well, now look, Miss Bart, I know it may seem strange after what's just happened and all, but... You mean you really don't want me talking about this to Mr. Vern? Isn't that it? He might think you'd been lying to him. What lovely material. Fine tailor cut that coat. Well, this is a hangover from the days when I was in the big money, five years ago. Five years ago. I knew they were always up to the fashion, but I didn't know they were ever that far ahead of it. Don't lie to me, Mr. Eager. Why not? Because I have no intention of reporting you. I better take you home. Billy, can you go out and find a cab for you and Jeff? I'm taking the car. Okay, boss. Where's your coat? Over there. Get it and wait up front. Are you buttoning your mouth, understand? Oh, Johnny, I'm a your friend. How I know what that rankin is. All right, all right, forget it. Uh, thanks, Johnny. So that's her, huh? Are you thinking of allowing her to play Roxanne to your Cyrano? Now, don't pin another can on, will you? My last duchess. But that blessed damsel will have you over a barrel, amigo, if she talks to the parole board. She won't. Mr. Freud, take a letter. Just off Wally Road. Let's stop all this Bush League nonsense. You don't want me to take you home and you know it. Of course I don't. Of course I don't want you to take me home. <laughs> 